Hello everyone, this is Ralph from Ralph's Trucking. Here I am, waiting to get my load. They sent me a message that I needed a PM1 and a PM2 done. I tried to get some done this weekend at Speed Coast. One in Pennsylvania on I-80 and one in Ohio on I-80. And each time they told me at least two and a half hours just to get me in the bay. So here I am, been empty since last night, waiting to get my load. It's supposed to be soon. And uh, I've been going through air filters for my CPAP like nothing else. This is basically two nights of use, and here's a brand new one. I'll talk about it a little bit more. And what do they find during oil change? How much is an oil change for a semi truck? Now, this was Retella uh, Synthetic Oil T5. Rotella T5 oil. So, cue the intro and watch go through the bill one by one and talk about price. Now, they do oil changes here at Tyson every 50,000 miles. Fuel filters and all at 25,000. So, fuel filters every 25,000. Well, drain the oil, replace it every 50,000 miles. So, cue the intro and let's talk about this bill. And what else did they find wrong with Ralph's truck? <laughs> my CPAP filter brand new this is my filter after two days wondering did I buy cheap filters off Amazon yes I did but one day two days so we ain't got my oil change done today As you can see 411 23. I got 1030 oil change with lube finder Rotella T5 at the price of $334. Which here's the filters oil filter, oil filter, oil filter, fuel filter, fuel filter, grease job, environmental fee. Top off washer fluid, fuel filter, $30.29, tire pass, inflate tires, five bucks, which I don't think they touched the, uh, the air. Loves antifreeze, $20, because they said it was three quarter of a gallon low. And cap air filter at $31.99 air filter for the truck $79.99 so for the merchandise was $411.26 $84 in labor sales tax at $34.04 and Tyson paid five hundred and thirty seven dollars for an oil change and here's with the tires so maybe that won't be after two days anymore. This is new. This is old. New. Old. <laughs> 